I'm my love show. I'm Lady Girl from around the way where we have culture, conversation, and community. And I am coming to y'all with some quick commentary about the situation that's happening with Krishan and Blueface. Now, I have been checked out from Krishan and Blueface, been been. And I really didn't want to talk about this because it's involving children and we all know I'm a mother first. And every Oh, wait, 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 wait. First things first, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel, period. If you're into cultural conversations, community, all of these types of things, make sure you like and subscribe because it's how I continue to grow on the platform. It's free. It helps me. I'm asking nicely. And also, too, I'm asking nicely, period. So let's just hop into it. Um, I really didn't want to touch this subject, although... I feel like a lot of people have already covered this. I wanted to wait on this because I wanted to see how Blueface was going to respond. He goes off and says that his phone was hacked. He go, he, His phone was stolen and then his Twitter was hacked. But he has yet to issue any sort of apologies or has shown any type of remorse for the hurt and damage that he has caused. Allegedly. Or even just his irresponsibility with having his phone. This whole idea that his phone was stolen and then also hacked. Well, what happened to Schoolyard Crip? Because as far as I'm concerned, you the, the roughest, toughest things out here with two fucking feet. How you getting your phone stolen and hacked, Blueface? You around a whole bunch of uh, 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 Schoolyard Crip guys. Let me, I don't want to say ninjas. I'm going to just say ninjas. But your phone was stolen and hacked by who? Who would do such a thing? And how can those things be measured? Because Krishan has recently said that she was going to be pressing charges. Do I think that she will press charges? Probably not. Do I think that she should? Absolutely. Absolutely. And if it, if it, if it wasn't for Blueface who did it, then whoever leaked, whoever leaked this, this photo should absolutely leak it. Um, should absolutely get charges pressed against them. So this is what happened. Um, Krishan is saying that, um, you know, she got all of these text messages coming to her phone and she didn't know what was going on. She thought that Blueface was just online, just tripping it like he normally do, like a regular degla Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, because this is what they do. We're, we're, we're seeing the cycle of abuse, the cycle of power and control play out before us, but that's neither here nor there. Krishan says she's, she's going to be pressing charges against Blueface for allegedly posting their child's genitalia. Now, he did this in a way to spite her. Apparently, the son has some sort of penile hernia or whatever the case may be. The images have been circulating on Twitter. I do not suggest you go over there and try to find it. Hopefully, Twitter or X or whatever it is, somebody has pulled it and snubbed it and scrubbed it clean from the internet because one, we already know there are too many predators. Too many predators out here. Too many predators out here to be playing with your own kid. Be so for real. Be so for real. Um, we already know that this man has no real clear boundaries or understandings of how you're supposed to handle children the way that we see him having his son around strippers, asking his son about um, sexual orientation at the tender age of six. I, I do want to say this because there are people who feel like, you know, by six or seven, you know, if you feel an attraction to somebody, okay, sure. You know, if you have, you like to have a little crush in kindergarten or whatever the case may be. But to say it on a public platform to a child who's already in the spotlight is completely unacceptable. And I don't care what y'all say about it. Oh, well, I knew I was gay or not. That, whatever. That's not what I'm saying here. And that's not the conversation. You went off to post this picture of your child to show what of a, what so much of a bad mom Krishan is. And that is the thing. Men and sometimes women will just go to the end to hurt somebody who they feel like has hurt them or has gotten over or has wronged them in some way. So much so that you expose you expose the mother of your child and in turn put naked photos of of your of your child of your newborn. He also goes on to say in this in the this Twitter rant, like, you know, this hernia was caused because she was drinking, she was smoking during her pregnancy. That's a lot of conversation for somebody who was just hacked your who hacked your phone, blue face. How? The hacker went to also research how did the child get this hernia? I feel like he crashed out. He macked out. He he couldn't compute. It, it, she's beyond her, her, you know, his control, and he had to do whatever he could 
And I hear, I heard her cry. I don't like listening to her cry. I do not watch her lives because it's just too toxic. Um, I just hate to watch it now at this point. It's just really sickening. And I'm living my own life. We own, we all have our own cross to bear. And I don't really feel like watching these teeny boppers play with their opportunity because they're truly both blessed to just be playing in our faces like this. So I really kind of checked out. I, I deal with Krishan on baddie seats for what it's worth, but all this I'm praying for Krishan and I'm doing I'm not doing all that. I'm not giving all the energy when it's real moms regular degla moms out here struggling hard who, who won't even y'all won't even hold the door open for homegirl she got the stroller the baby y'all won't even do that but y'all have all of this great energy for Krishan I hate it actually to be quite honest with you it's very frustrating um to see Y'all playing our faces like this. Even the celebrities, Kiki Palmer, who's come out to say something. Um, Tamika Mallory, uh, or whatever her name is, girl, please. Go donate to a local women's shelter where it's women right now in a hotel room. Women who are in a shared living space with their very young children. With less opportunity, with, with, with little to no help resources who are truly marginalized. And also trying to rear children. Girl, let me move on swiftly and maybe not so professionally because that's really doing it for me. Um, so Krishan is crying. She's like, Blue, why would you do this? Blue, why would you do this? You could just hear her pain as a mother. Like, why would you put this out here to my son? The point that he was trying to make was you doing all of this back and forth at the at the uh, job fair, you at the football game, you at the church, you're doing dedication, and your son needs surgery. Somebody mentioned too, like, you know, it most recently came out that she was at Walmart with the dog and with her baby at Walmart. And this is a first time mother. Blueface posted something too. Like, why would you take the dog and a newborn to Walmart? Dumb, dumb, that makes no sense. Let me tell you something very quickly. For a person who never came from having a family, a functional family in this way, I can see very easily and very quickly her feeling like, you know what, I'm gonna take my dog and I'm gonna take my son because I'm the queen mother and I'm getting it done. And you're, <laughs> when you're in this space of, she's not even two, three weeks postpartum, y'all. She's not fully, y'all ever hear pregnancy brain? Well, this it still continues at least minimum six weeks after you have that baby. She's not thinking clearly. She's not thinking clearly, of course. I mean, she wasn't really thinking too clearly before then. Hello? Hello? So... She took her son and her dog because they are her, they are her love, prized possessions. And I want to have my dog, and I want to have my son. And I'm out here, and I'm going to Walmart. I'm doing. I'm getting a couple of things. Now, back to Krishan, um, to Blueface leaking the photos. Girl, this man is trash. His 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 phone was not hacked. The 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 hacker stole the phone, leaked the photos, gave a medical description, outlined reasons that the child got a hernia. And then he magically appears on Twitter with a new a new phone. And it's sad to say, Krishan is not going to press charges. She's not because she don't she she still loves him. But I feel like at any at any situation, any point of abuse, that a woman should ultimately choose to be the safety of her children and herself and her mental health. Just the other day, you know, she was posting like, "I'm not going to add to her to her her plate her burden. She already has a lot. It's a lot. I can only imagine being a mom at 23 what is she 23 24 right and then having uh those spotlight of the world now does she call it on to herself oh absolutely because it's it's almost like a drug you feel what i'm saying she has to have that's what she's going for it's salacious that's what that's how she makes a, a livelihood for herself um blue face is trash i feel like although Krishan has had um you know she she chose to be with this man she chose to steal him from you know uh <laughs> Jaden and Alexis. Well, T.S. Wilson say you, you put your trust in a nigga, stupid hoe, how you figure. She has to be accountable for her actions and, and the choosing of this man. You see how he was going to already dog Jaden and Alexis. Like, what did you think he was going to get, Krishan? You keep bringing this man back into your, your, you know, into your space. And you like, I'm trying to keep him at bay and I don't want him to take my children. I really do think that she's scared that he's going to try to take the kid. And I don't even think that he would do it to, to really want to have this child. But just to spite her because... Blueface was a lick for her. Ain't no way to flip it, dip it, slice it, or slice it. Blueface was a dip, was a real lick for her, and she came up. And she has, in the court of public opinion, she is going to get more support, and even now more than ever, than him. What y'all think about the situation? Drop down in the comments. I am just sick about it. I just cannot involving this very, very innocent newborn child is unbelievable. The baby needs help as well as they.
period, point blank. As always, I'm sending you much love and much light, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.